But I can tell you now, stage three, I have high hopes that this will not disappoint in the difficulty level. We've already seen that these uh, r incredibly annoying grapple things have made their umpteenth appearance, so let's try to get somewhere here. And uh, not to these spiders, but uh, definitely we're uh, meeting our doom in the animal department in the cave. I can't tell if that yellow outline is just them being possessed or what, but uh, definitely there's something fishy going on, and I love that little death animation when he falls to the ground. Uh, we just took on that same uh, bat formation. You guys are getting stale already. Okay. So, let's head up here. Yeah, we've got one of these fellas. Always nice to see he's uh, in the business. And uh, we're just going to play a standard uh, bait and switch here. As we've done countless times. Hopefully we uh, do not run into too much trouble. We've got our yellow key as we deserve. And uh, heading out this door. Alright, so now we need to find the yellow door. And uh, knowing the level designers, it's going to be on the opposite side of the world. But let's just hang out here for a bit. And now let's see what's in this door over here. Uh, well, first of all, some ninjas. And uh, for once... Uh, Gray ninja guy didn't take me out, but yellow did. Freaking snakes on the bottom there. Alright, well, let's get back there. Alright, we got a beam guy over here, so... Hey, let's just, uh... Let's just deal with him. And save a hostage around here, so... And he drops... Okay, that's a heart. Okay. Alright, just a little diversion there. Got a lot of hostages to rescue, so, uh... We'll be doing that quite often. Slow down there, Joe. Keep it calm. Alright, we're back in this door. Feeling good about taking out these ninjas. Let's just wait for that guy to attack and then uh, kind of just attack like that because it's hard to jump slash in this area. Alright, so we need to get down to those snakes. Those snakes. And let's wait for them to get out of the middle and then hang out on this uh, box. Is there any way to take them out from here? Probably not. So let's just take them out one by one. And we'll wait for them to get over here. Ugh. Okay, well, they took out snakes. Got the blue key. And I assume there's going to be a hostage down here. Oh, two hostages. Held hostage by none other than Boomerang Man himself. Which they're really giving Boomerang Man a bad rap in this level. In this whole cave area. Because they always give us boxes to duck behind. When you could easily take them out without the boxes. I'm not saying I'm thankful. Not thankful for the boxes, but come on, man. Let's have a little challenge here. I can't believe I'm saying that. And this boss. Can't wait to take on the boss in this thing, God. Didn't he say a bat magic? Well, last time the guy had animal-related magic. It really didn't work out too well for me, so, uh... Jeez. Okay, so we have the blue key and the gold key, neither of which we've actually used yet. Um, so let's drop down here. And let's try to cross over into this area. Alright, well we got the blue key here. Obviously we need to get hit by that bat in the most cool way possible, actually. Okay, so the blue key has the way to the red door, but we've also got quite the uh, upper area here, so... Let's go exploring. Can we get this bat to come down? Yes, we can. We can also get us hurt. Luckily, by the bat and not the spikes because of an invincibility frame. Something which, sadly, doesn't exist in real life. Okay, so this guy's kind of being an awkward guy here, but, uh... Tell you what, let's come up here. <laughs> said let's come up here. Well, did he just shoot at the wall? Okay, that guy's an idiot. Um, let's get over to the other side. Obviously, we can't do that like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't get di- Joe, don't get dizzy. Okay. Okay. Head me up here. And let's see what's in here. Nice little energy upgrade. And we've got a spiked platform here. Always nice to have around. Can't see why they have to be spiked. It's just, uh, I guess the game can't handle you grappling onto the, the bottom of that. It's probably why that's going on, actually. So let's get on this platform. We've got a happy little flamethrower man on both sides. Luckily we took that guy out pretty easily, and this other guy's aim is worse than, uh, me playing any sport ever, but uh, he still manages to get us, but I'm not that worried. 
I don't think I'll make it into the major leagues anytime soon, so, you know, I'm being dead and all. So we got a hostage and a red key, awesome. So now all we need to do is rescue the 80 billion hostages we need to rescue. And, as always, fall into the spikes, because, you know, who's going to remember that those are there? Alright, so, well, let's get hit by that bat and head over to the yellow door here. Now we got our favorite enemy, the snake, a hostage. I don't know where we're going to find the rest of the four hostages, but this open room looks like a place for some ninjas to be, so let's take out those guys. Yep, lots of ninjas in this area, and, uh... Luckily we took them out all out pretty easily, except for these ones. I have a feeling this guy's gonna kill me, because the last guy always ends up killing me. And, uh, yeah, he's doing a pretty good job of avoiding me so far, and yes, I'm dead. Okay, well, we know what's going on in that room. Jeez. Alright, this time I'm gonna just head over this way, because... Well, I need... should probably get the, the keys first. Durr. Oh my god. Okay, I can't really remember where we were last time, but, uh, I'm just gonna head up here. Oh yeah, this is the place of the ninjas. Okay. So I didn't go in the blue door this time, uh, first, because that has the red key and the red door, which, uh, getting that would be kind of pointless. So, let's just start in here, and these yellow guys are getting surprisingly annoying to kill, considering they're the first, uh, ninja guy you ever encounter, and they should be the easiest, but, uh, these silver guys are still pretty annoying. Hopefully they're not too tricky. Red guy is still the easiest. Okay, so we rescued that hostage. And I guess we're heading over here. And got some snakes in the upper level. I don't know. Are we allowed to take them out with ninja stars or what? I'm so confused by that. Okay, can we use our Yeah, we can we can use our snake stick here to take out the snakes. That's kind of awesome. So let's do that. Oh, we got a stupid... Luckily we have full energy here, because... Those blue guys, you basically need full energy to take them out. They're impossible. Okay, so we took him out. Let's get his energy. Be pinky. Rescue our pavilion hostage. And kind of seizure through this passageway. Wow, that is... That's not a ninja move. I don't know what is. Okay, you know there's going to be a ninjas in this area. Yep, called it. Luckily those red guys are like cannon fodder, so... Was there another hostage in there? No, that was it, right? Okay, yeah. Okay, we got two more hostages. Um, oh, they must be in the blue door. I can't really remember how many were in there, but uh, there's nowhere else to go, so let's just head right over there. Oh, there's no green door in this uh, this place. Okay, so we're back in here. Yeah, we got this upper haunt here. Ah, oh, freaking bats! And. Oh my god. I don't think I'm going to make it this time, am I? I guess we took out the, that bat. Jesus. Okay, what do we got up here? Oh, we got a bazooka man. Alright, well, he's pretty easy. Take him out, and, uh... Let's try to make it over to that without that causing too much trouble. Got some energy. Full energy, that's kind of weird. Well, that'll be nice if we can keep that before the boss fight, but, uh... I can't remember if getting this... Well, we're dead now. Wow, that is a spectacular death. <laughs> Jeez, okay. Well, we know what to do. Let's do. I'm a snake. Be the snake. Be the snake. I'm a little faster than the snake. I don't want to catch up to the snake. I want the snake to turn around, and I want to chop its head off. Alright, got our red key. Rescued all... Wait. We didn't rescue all our hostages. We still want to rescue... Oh, where is he? Let's see. Oh, what's up that bull? That doesn't look good. That door is quite, uh, the mossy door there. Okay, well, we still have one more hostage to rescue. Where is he? Oh, I think I know where he is. Remember when we rescued that hostage on the, uh... Yeah, he's right up there. Okay. Well, let's not get hit by this bit. Well, obviously we're gonna get hit by the bat. Okay, yeah, let's head up here. Yep, there he is. There's Flamethrower Man. Ugh, we got the good flamethrower right through the uh, thing there, so... Let's not get flamethrowered again. Get our health. And, hey, we're not a uh, pinky, but we do have full energy and uh, feeling pretty good. We'd get damage in the boss fight anyway the very first second, so... 
Anyway, let's head through the red door. Got all the hostages rescued, and uh, hey, we uh, completed stage three. That wasn't too bad at all, actually. Uh, a little backtracking, but anyway, here we go. The bats form together to make big bat dude. Wow, that uh. So apparently we're fighting a vampire here. And uh, okay, okay, we got bats. Bats flying. Uh, we've got some stuff we need to get here. What's in these packages? What's in these? Oh, stupid bats! Quit it. Okay, what's in these? Okay, health and something else. Probably another energy source. Yes, health. Okay, so they're giving us a lot of health, which means this boss is going to be annoying as hell. And these bats are annoying as hell. Jesus Christ! Okay, okay. Well, okay. Can we take care of these bats first? Oh my God! This is. Oh, this is just annoying. Okay, well, we just damaged him there from our spinning jump attack, so that's not bad at all. But now we're dead. Okay, well, this is going to be a pain. Alright, Batman. Let's do this. Oh my god, so we got our freaking bats. How are we... Jesus Christ, this is going to be the most annoying battle ever. Okay, luckily he's kind of... He's definitely got a pattern here. And uh, we can damage him with our spin attack, which does a ton of damage, so... Let's just wait over here for now. Wait for him to come back over. And as soon as he jumps back over here, we'll spin attack him. Alright, so, so far, okay, and he makes more bats, but hey. Nothing a ninja can't handle, so let's take care of the bats. Okay, and he, he's always calling more bats, got it. So now I think he's calling bats, like, between every meal here. Which is gonna get extra annoying. Okay, and the bats are also really annoying. But, you know, what are bats to a ninja? This looks like it's going to be a lot of bat wrangling and uh, this guy handling. So he comes over here, we just uh, spin attack him. We've already got him down to almost half health. This guy isn't really hard at all. So, as long as we can uh, handle the bats, shouldn't be this much of a problem. Yeah, that spin attack is a godsend in a lot of battles. Oh my god, this is the most boring boss fight ever. And we can even do one of these, too, once he gets on screen here. We can even shoot him when he's over there. God, this is the this is so easy. Look at that, we, we already got him down to, like, no health. Okay, alright, you got your bats. I get it, you're trying to, you're trying to change it up a bit by uh, sending your bats in, but, uh, really that's not much of an issue for me, man. I mean, I'm sorry to say, but bats are not that intimidating. They're really not. I've, I've, I've seen quite my share of bats in my day, and uh, I'm kind of over it. Yeah, we killed... Oh, that was the second try. We killed... That was... Oh my god, guys, that was the easiest boss ever. Oh, finally, we saved Shirtless Man. Thank god. Man, do we need a close-up of that? That's a little weird. Okay, so we complete the cave, which, uh, wow, that was easy, and, uh, now we're heading to the base. Six stars, guys! You know, back in the heyday of Yukio, that was, like, some serious business. I think, if I can remember correctly. Anyway, uh, looks like we're headed to, uh, we're really going on the offensive now, and, uh, we're heading directly to their base, or some base. Uh, so we got 408, 600 points, and, uh, yeah. So, this is Rowan C23 Centrifuge Gaming, and, uh, that came as a nice surprise at the end there. Anyway, uh, I guess I'll see you next time on Ninja 5 <laughs> Oh my god. Stupid Batman. He's already a Batman. You can't be Batman. Jesus Christ, man. Oh, bats.